special special guest special guest in the building. Yes. Yeah, what are you? I'm gonna just keep I'm gonna just keep it right here. We ain't, I ain't seen this. I ain't seen this nigga in like. <laughs> you should be used to. Wait, wait. Oh me? What's that happening? Yeah, my forehead kind of shoddy, y'all. It's the light that's right under me. This nigga used jerky and shit. Who would be Who would be your your all time battle that you would want to see? My all time battle? Yeah. My all time battle. Hmm. That's a good question. I still want to see Mooks who surf. Mooks who surf. I, I see. I see that. Um. I don't know, because a lot of the battles I wanted to see happened already. Yeah, because it's like, it's only so many people in the league. Yeah, so like, a lot of the battles like, I wanted to see. Who would be, like, from old to new to everything, who would be your top battle that you would want to see? Shit, this is about to happen. Lux and Verb. I feel like Verb going to whoop him. Lux ain't won a battle since Calico. Yeah. After he battled Calico, they put him on a pedestal, but he ain't won nothing after that. Yeah, he ain't What battle has he won after that? What battle kills me is, so he battled Charlie Clips. Charlie Clips is gonna go first, right? But he was crying about the coin toss. Hey, that that shit was like he fucking won the. I, so I, first, I, I gotta watch that one again. So that, but that, Clips but that, was I, I about to go so. first, right? Yeah, I had that. But coin he was coin. crying about the coin bat, the mm-hmm. coin toss, right? Mm-hmm. So they they flipped the coin. He um, Charlie Clips won. Mm-hmm. So the only reason you gonna bitch about the coin talk, the coin talk, is because he wanna go first, right? Right. But he was. Oh, there we, there we go. And he was like, put it again. This yeah. hard. Here we oh. go. Jimmy Shoe trying. Oh, the nigga want. Oh, you on real nigga time now. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. John, hit hit the hit the request, bro. I will request you. Okay, we on real nigga time now. Okay. There you go. What up, though? Oh, sir. Sir, base, sir. <laughs> sir, base. <laughs> there you go. What's good? What's up, Yo. though? What's poppin'? What's oh, poppin'? man. Can't call it. How about you? Chillin', same old shit. Real nigga time. <laughs> All day. The only time to be on. Yeah, you know I mean, for real. You gotta tell a nigga. First, you gotta be a real nigga. Time, time. <laughs> what's up? What's up? What's up? Hey, let hey for the people that been you know sleeping under a rock. Let everybody know who you are and what you do. Oh, well, I mean, so for the people who don't know, I mean, <laughs> Mr. Battle rap extraordinaire. I came from the battle rap scene. I'm on the MTV's Wildin' Out. Um, I mean, basically, my job was to put niggas in body bags on the battle rap scene. <laughs> <laughs> and I did just that. So now I just got to do it on television now. That's all. Straight up. Hey, stop the beat. Hey, D- DJ <laughs> D-Rack. Why is everybody trying to jock to stop the beat, though? And the crazy everybody. part, the, the crazy part is the producers tell him, yo, <laughs> Only conceited can cut the beat, and niggas yeah. still do it. Right? <laughs> like all your guests try to come cut the beat, but that means you a staple, though. That means you can't go. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah. That's the. Right. I mean, that's the good part about it. But the thing about it is, if they gonna do it, they gotta do it right. They gotta be like, "Hey, yo, DJ D Ray, cut the beat." Right. They be like, "DJ, DJ, stop the beat, please, please." Yeah. I know. They be like, I know. They will be like, "Yo, DJ, DJ, turn that shit off, turn off real quick." Right? Yeah, right. Yeah, you yeah. fucking it up. All right, so of course, while, while we blending you in here, tell us about the Jimmy Shootron page, how it came about, what made you start to get getting on it. We always kind of know you for sure, battle rap shoehead. If you know of you, you know what I mean. Right, what right. got you getting going the page? Um, what really made made me do it because I wanted to keep my page, my original page, just basically more of me and work and shit like that. Where the shoe picks, I mean, I would put them up there for a few days, but then delete them. Because I just had, like, a certain theme that was going on with, with my page. So I was like, yo, you know what? Fuck it. Why don't I just make a page strictly for my kicks? Therefore, yeah. whenever when, whenever I want to see even one of the pictures or if, or if anybody else want to see all, yeah, all of my shoes, they don't have to go through a whole bunch of pictures that they don't give a fuck about. They can just see the pictures of straight kicks. So that's exactly how it came about. Hey, would you, would you say... Maybe for me, 
Would you be the Jersey King next to Fab? Hey, look, I just was about to ask him. <laughs> yeah. Kick the jerseys, like <laughs> definitely a hundred percent. Jersey King. I mean, for real, because I'm like, God damn, this nigga see got another goddamn jersey, hey, bro. Daddy, yeah, I mean, I still have mad jerseys I haven't even worn yet. I still got mad shit I haven't worn yet. I believe it. Hey, <laughs> I believe shout it. Shout out to Mr. Throwback. Fact. Right. You know what I mean? For but, real. but, you know, but, but Fab been doing it, you know what I mean? When I was in, like, fucking right. middle school and all that, you know, watching music videos and all that, so. Word. You I know. was like, I, if he won, he for sure, too. Yeah, yeah, that's if. <laughs> if he won. I mean, it's, I mean it's, a, it's still a fight. It's still a fight. So I don't know who got number one yet. Word. Hey, so um, how did you start battle rap? Let's let's start with that first. Let's get on some battle rap shit, who you are, and then we're going to talk about some sneakers. Um, well, I started battle, battle rap. Well, like, being from um, New York, we used to always cut class and get the smack DVDs. Right. Go to the hood, go to the hood spot, get the smack D DVDs, get some Chinese food, go to the crib, watch them, boom, boom, boom. We all know mother come home at five, six. We got to help him be out and act like we're coming home from school after <laughs> or whatever, whatever. So I I used to do that. I used to see the Murder Mook joints. Murder Mook was battling, um, at first, uh, Jay Mills. That's the first one I saw, Murder Mook versus J Mills. That was Smack DVD Volume Four, I believe. So I went back and saw Volume Ray Three, which was, which was great, which was J Mills versus a dude named Castro. And then Five came out, which was Mook versus Lux, and so on and right. so forth. And then from that point on, I was like, "Yo, this is fire! I like this. This is what I want to do." And right. I always had punchlines in my head. I never thought about being a rapper or nothing, but I always thought about ill lines every here and there. Never, never put them on paper. Never did anything. I mean, put your journal. And um, and then basically that was that was what got me into battle rap. Like right. as far as being a major fan, and wanted to do it was was the Smack DVDs. Okay. Now, uh -huh. Uh -huh. as far as me starting it, I linked up with my homie Fox from California. I already <laughs> had battles in um in New York in Lions Den with Loaded Lux hosting, but it never came right. out. So my right, man right. Cali was like, yo, we're going to start our own shit. Fuck it. Come out here. Let's do a battle. I'll put it online the next day, nigga. I was like, that's, right, jungle. that's the jungle, right? Right. Right. Yeah. The jungle. So did that, and that shit took off. And that's how Battle Rap started for me. Straight up. What, what would you say was probably your, your, your favorite battle? Hmm. Well, my favorite battle probably, it would be out of... Ill Mac or Grind or um Arsenal. And okay. now I think I had battles where I've done better that I like, but the reason why those are my favorite cause they just put both of those battles would put me on different plateaus. Like beating Ill Mac was the reason why I can I was able to battle Arsenal. Okay. You know what I mean? So and battling Arsenal was the battle that got me into the mainstream, I guess, because that battle it was huge. I mean, at that time, it was the most viewed battle for the longest. Like, we thought nobody ever was going to catch us. So, right. those would be my two favorites. Okay. <laughs> Me, personally, I always fuck with battle rap, but when I meet some people that haven't fucked with battle rap and they're like, let's watch a battle, what I put on is conceited versus dumbfounded. Oh, yeah, yeah. And see? <laughs> and, there, and there we go. Now, see, for that particular joint, nobody who's ever watched battle rap that's a perfect battle to put on because it's nothing really too crazy to think about in that battle it's nothing it's not like it's too many hidden messages or gems where you have to be a battle fan it's just right. straight good good ass lines good jokes boom 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 so that's definitely the battle with somebody who never watched battle rap i think that would be the end Right. That's the one I always put on because it's like it's not really like steered towards gun bars right. or whatever. Right, right, Just right, right. Pure battle rap. Mm -hmm. I don't like. I say either that one. I say you, you and B Magic. Me, see, me and B Magic. Now that's a battle for somebody who like bars. The nigga who like punchlines. That's a battle to put on. For somebody who's never seen battle rap before, they can really get lost in that battle. Cause I I know I had to watch that I, I still can't say who won that one because I, I still watch that one to this day. 
Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that battle was was crazy. That's actually one of my like favorites as far as all time. Word. What's the last battle you had? You and Big K? No, the last battle I had was me and Chill Jones. Okay. So when are you coming back to battle rap? I don't know, man. Smacking them, keep on trying to tease me with all this money. So and look at Shanky, baby. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, I mean. They just they, the funny part is they texted me literally today. They texted me and said, "Let's do Summer Madness in London in September." Mm. Who, 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 who they I mean, you know, with somebody like you know, really, you get to pick your own opponents when you get to a certain caliber of battle rap. But the only three that make sense not there's two that make sense for me. One is Rum Nitty, and the other one is Tay Rock. I was say you gotta be Tay Rock. Yeah, Tay Rock been and, out for a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Tay Rock would be that would be the match, like the grudge match. Everybody want to see where, or he's been, you know, that was supposed to go down for so long. And with Rum and with Rum Nitty, and with Rum Nitty, he just who the fuck is that? Why'd you save this? Because we should go for a bit, Andrew. Yeah, but then um, uh, what 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 did I just say? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Um, so from Nitty, Tay, Tay Rock, and Cassidy. So that's the Cassidy. Three. Yeah. You know you missed okay. right? Not Cassidy with the notepad. Yeah. Was, that was, that no, was, nigga, that was Cassidy. That was cannabis. Oh, that was, that was cannabis with the with the notepad. Okay. <laughs> this thirty even pages of rhymes. This motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Can't do, can't do, can't do. Yeah, okay, sure. so we gonna see we gonna see Khan back on Smack this year. Very 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 Still high hook. Okay, we gonna be looking for the high okay. okay. Okay, what shoe got you into sneakers? That got me into sneakers. See, the thing is, I can't say what what got me into sneakers because. I was like born into this shit. You know what I mean, like yeah, I really had no choice. It was kind of like some gangbanging shit. Paul, like I was born like my older brothers and sisters, especially my sister. My sister had all the crazy sneakers because she was she was like on some tomboy shit, so she had all the fire. So I mean, my first pair of Jordans were were the. Hold on, this shit. Yeah. All right. My first joints were the um, Jordan Sevens. Okay, okay. Pair Sevens, Bordeaux. No, oh. um, I guess you want to call. We just pulled up. It wasn't the Raptors up. back then, but. I mean, oh yeah, okay. Right. Gotcha. We got. You. So, I said we just pulled up in the parking lot. So those were my my first ones, and then I, I and I remember, her boyfriend came through huh? with the eight, which were which were the Aqua Eights. And, okay. If I have to say which one did it, it's definitely that one. Okay. All right. Uh, all right. We well, yeah. Definitely, definitely. Matter of fact, yeah, I'm gonna walk on the street. One thing we stay, one thing we stay staying on a podcast and the show is that one thing we inspire either everybody get inspired where you got your shoe swag from, but we say the D boys and, and hoopers only. Huh? I said one thing we where you get you your D boys and 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 um and um hoopers. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hold on one second. My fault. No, you good. You good. This nigga right here is looking at me as if. Oh, all right. Oh, so we can't park. Park there. All right. One more time. Oh, no. What I was saying was what we always say on the podcast is that a lot of us get our swag where we got where we got our initial sneaker source from or where you see swag come was from either the D-Boys or basketball players. Would you agree? Oh, oh yeah. I mean. Basketball players will be definitely all but strictly book because of Mike. Yeah, of course. Of course. That means, yeah. So But outside of I that, mean, if you weren't the basketball player, you would you, you gotta at least see the you feel me, it would be the D boys that you seen walking around the hood. Yeah, it would and see, then again, I was so young at, at the time I wouldn't know what what their business was in the streets, but it definitely was True. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but it definitely were the cool niggas on the block. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> yeah, yeah. that's a good label. Yeah, you know I mean. What yeah, you think? True. What you think about the sneaker game right now, today? I, I think it's nowhere near the same. Nowhere near, near the same, and I think it's simply because of oversaturation. 
I mean, like even even like a Jordan One is they make a zillion of those every single month now. The foams they the foams they they, they had the vote because they made CS so much. So like it's basically to the point now. You I don't know if you remember like let's say like probably back when it was in middle school high school. Somebody will come to school with a pair, with just a, a pair of Jordans, and we'll be like, "Damn, we got the Jordans on." And right. Now it's so many. It's just all right. Somebody's gonna have a pair of Jordans. It may not be a lit pair. Yeah, but yeah, right. But you yeah, gonna have, have it. Yeah, like somebody's gonna have it on. I went to the mall the other day. Me and my man was on um, talking about it, and can't give you an exact an exact number, but majority of the dudes and, and younger chicks were all wearing Jordans. You know, like I said, some of them were, you know, some, like some probably team Jordans and some could have been some, some true black like so <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Or like, I mean, you know, somebody could have had, you know, some true blues, which are legendary and fire, but, you know, in this right. day and age right now, the true blue is not what what it was to us. I mean, it's still, exactly. It's, exactly. It's, it's still holds that value to me but you know, to Correct. the younger dudes, you know, you know, it's just like yeah. some just some normal shit to, to them. Yeah. But so it was just mad people yeah, who had it on. I'm just like, damn, this is back in the days. This well, this is back in the days, this never would have happened. Period. Only a handful of people would have um would have had it. So I think that overset that oversaturated shit plays a very big part. Very, very big part. It's to the point now, let's say if you was to walk in the mall with some crazy shit. Talking about some crazy Jordan samples nobody ever seen. The majority of the masters who don't, which they don't know, they're just going to think, okay, that's a pair that came out in the mall that I missed, that I just didn't right. see. For sure. Or, or they fake. <laughs> or, they, they, yeah, they or, fake. Or, or, or fake. Well, yeah. That's fucked up. Well, let me ask, since y'all, because y'all be having shoe game on the show. Y'all be having shoe game on the show, so is that all y'all personal collections? Is Nick has got J's for y'all in the back? How'd that go? Uh, we do have wardrobe, but no, I mean, the Jordans, there's no Jordans really for the men. Right. It's really for the good. They only have small sizes for the girls. Okay. And it might be a couple, like, big sizes, but for the most part, like, Chico got crazy shit. I was about to say that. She, like, he... Say. Like, he basically, he the same way. He was, like, he was just born into the shit, addicted to it. He can't help you. I was going to say, you, Chico, and E usually always got shit on. For sure. Yeah, always. yeah, yeah. Oh, and here's the thing with E, man. He has so <laughs> much fire shit like, that he doesn't wear. I went to his crib. Yeah. He went to his closet. I said, what the fuck? Why you not wearing this thing? Like, I don't know. I just I just have the certain joints that I, you know, I like, and I just keep on wearing those. Yeah. And he has mad shit. Yeah, Damn I was man. like, don't quote me. I was like, I, when I watched the, uh, what was that? When I watched, what last episode did they just have? Uh, Mini Mom? That might, might have been. I can't remember. No, no, I think the Goody Mob episode. Mm. Uh -oh, but when I watched that, see, yeah, because he had uh, the vapor, I mean, uh, he had the vapor zone. Mm. The all white yeah, yeah, vapor. Yeah. I, like, I ain't never had seen him wear that before. Right. <laughs> he mm -hmm. just pulled them out. So, yeah. And, yeah, he, he, and he got, and he got, oh, no, he has two. He has the white one and then the. No, matter of fact, he has the first one, the all black with the white check. And yeah. He has, and he has the all white pair. And I think he just copped the black on black ones. Okay. Yeah. You can definitely see it influences the rest of the show to try to come icy now. Like the swag of the show completely uh, changed from season to season. For sure. Huh? I said, I said, you can tell y'all have influenced the rest of the show too. To kind of come hard because the swag. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. From season to season. Yep, right. facts. You gotta make a left on 20. Facts. Extra facts. For sure. I'll For say, sure. Hitman is the GR King. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hitman is GR King. Hitman, Hitman is Lance Stevenson. I did. Nigga, you took my shit. You <laughs> took my shit. Hey, look, was, get his last Stevenson. I was just about to say that he's the Lance Stevenson of Wallin' Out. Yeah, right. For real. <laughs> For and real, the thing, man. the thing with Hitman, though, he's crazy. He, all them shoes he bought four or five times over already. He'll buy them, wear them, lose them, give them away, <laughs> fuck them up, just buy another one, another one, another. Right. I'm like, yo, you're like, I don't understand, man. Like, I could never do that, ever. Yeah.
Hitman be hooping in this shit. <laughs> he don't want or be them people. Do you know walk in be like, bro? If I can't walk in and just grab the shoe, I don't want it. Mm -hmm. Like if he I can walk red elevens like five times. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what we get. And that's what we get this year. I think that's rumor. Bread elevens for Christmas. Yes, uh, allegedly. Yep. No, they, they, they OG come. with the high cut. With the high yeah. cut. You high know they. Cut. You know they coming. So you like? Do you you feeling the high cuts or no? Um, I. Because of what it stands for, yeah, but since I was used to the low cut, I like the low cut better because mm -hmm. that's what because that's what I got as I mean younger. Up, I yeah. never had I never had the original the originals like in like in ninety six. I never had them. My right. first pair of elevens were the bread retros in what two in two thousand, two thousand one? Just I wanna say yeah. 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 Oh, one, yep, yep, yep. Oh, one, yeah. So that was that was my first. But I mean, I got all the ones. Then right. I got the. Oh no, I'm bugging. I'm I'm bugging. I'm bugging. No, my first elevens were the Space Jam. Okay. okay. In two thousand, two thousand, two thousand one, whichever one it was. I believe yeah. two thousand. I believe two thousand. Yeah. Now we see, we see you though, like for sure you. You done stepped the game up on Wild and Out. Everybody trying to bring out some heat now and everything. I was about to say, shit, in, in battle rap, <laughs> nigga, he was Period. one of the yeah. freshest niggas. Yeah, in battle rap, though, man, they, <laughs> them niggas, man. I mean. Hey, so if you, if, if you battle Rum Diddy, you going to talk about his uh, blue fives he had on? Of, of course. <laughs> of course. I have to. It's a must. I have to. <laughs> now, he, he left himself open with those, though. When he came out with those, he left himself up. Yeah, like I don't understand. I mean, he probably figured nobody was gonna find, was just gonna realize or find out. I have no idea. Nah, he he, he was tripping. He was tripping. So but, hey, how did, you, how did you hook up? Because Sneaker Slut Twenty Three is a is a very close person to our uh, podcast. How you hook up with him? Just me being thirsty on Instagram. <laughs> you deal with him? <laughs> that's stressful. Like that's about it, cause like I was um. Oh, you might hit my door. Yeah, pull up. Cause you um, I was just when I first, I was just starting to find mad people, and I'm just like, oh, he got shit, he got crazy shit, crazy shit, crazy shit. Let me hit him, let me hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. And he was one of the dudes I came across. I'm like, oh, his shit, super crazy. Right. So, yeah. build build a relationship with him. Got some joints from him. I got some more stuff coming from him. Oh yeah, so. you can't go wrong with him. He gonna definitely hit you with some PEs, all type of samples, all right. type of. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can't go wrong with that. Yeah, I no. got something. What, I what's got. In your what's in your rotation for this week? Yo, you know what's so funny? I even tried one time to to do that. Just even for a picture on Instagram, I'm like, yo, let me. It was right, it was right there. So. And I was like, but yo, I just can't because one day I'll look at something and be like, nah, you know what? I, I want to wear this instead. Then look to the left and see a shirt. Oh, that shit goes with this instead. So I, my shit is completely random, 100. percent Right now I have on the the yeah the blank Yeezy ones. Okay. Okay. So you. Yeah, right, right, right. Where y'all? What city y'all in right now? We in my, we in Miami. Oh, okay, okay. That's why I said yeah. he was coming for the club. I was, talking to. I was saying, look like it was, it look real Miami yeah. vice in the back. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Split up on us after the club. Hey, hey no, 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 nigga. We about to go into the club. Oh, okay, oh, okay, okay, okay. This is Miami. You go to the club at yeah, yeah, right about there, yeah. right about there. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they only, they only giving us fifty seconds left. Hey, Con, you, you hopped on real nigga time, a little late, so they only giving us 50 seconds. We're going to end it and come right back and try to, you know, get a couple more questions out before you hit the club. All right, well, I'm about to walk in. But, I, I mean, we could do this shit again. I mean, I'm here all all day, every day. If it's about like, shoes, just, I'm, I'm in. Yeah, we just got to get you on the right time. All right, bet. All right, all right real quick, before you go, we need uh -huh. that heat hoarders bar on Wild and Out for us. Give us that good. I got you. <laughs> that I got you. That bar on Wild and Out. Say that. Feel me? I'm a DCR yeah. the hell out of that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> we appreciate right, you, bro. Guys. My man. All right, appreciate it, bro. Until next right. time.
Ah, yo, B. Yo. Yep. Just like that, goddammit. <clears throat>、Max、95 still, they, they still up there. Yeah, yeah, man. They for sure my top fives. They're not my top. They're not my top. I went to school、though. in Union City, and we called Air Max 95s Fade 'em ups. Fade 'em ups. Only niggas from Union City would know that. Fade 'em ups. But we called them Fade 'em ups. <clears throat> so Fade 'em ups is definitely gonna be in my rotation for March. A lot of 90s. Yeah, 90s. I'll pull out a lot of GRs, and then a lot of Air Max that people don't know. That's Air Max like no Nomos, yeah, Griffies. Bulldogs. Yeah, I just. I wear all type of all that type of shit in the、uh, March. I just for sure just gave my pop some uh some Air Max ones too. Air Max ones, shit like yeah, that. Yeah, that's that's my favorite. That's my favorite Air Max one. I seen that uh seven twenty on feet. How does it look? They look dope as fuck. They do. Okay, because on by picture, them motherfuckers look like. They, space you know they only drop them in females so far. Oh, for real? I didn't know that. They look so like space boots. Once they drop them in men, I'm pretty sure we'll get some some man pictures. <laughs> yeah, they motherfuckers look like space boots. You ain't fucking with them? Not not off picture, no. But you seen them in person, so you got to you got to do. I just seen them in person, but I seen somebody on foot, and they just look they look dope. Cause I'm a fan of big air bowls, so、okay. sure. yeah, I got I got to see them on foot. <laughs> Like I said, they look like space boots. <clears throat> they look like、uh, <clears throat> if if in 1997 somebody thought of 2019 and made those. <laughs> cause I was just I was just.、Uh, cause look, cause I got, I got this Genesis, I got the Sega Genesis collection game on、uh, Xbox, and I was playing the game, and that motherfucker said in the year 2015. This what the world was looking like. This what the world is was supposed to look like, and all the shit, and just how it looked compared to what 2015 really looked like is like. That's what I thought. That's what I think. Motherfuckers that made them Air Max 720s was thinking about 1997, 2019. This is what 2019 is gonna look like. This shoot. <laughs> about to kill him in the club tonight. <laughs> Anything with big air bubbles, Griffies, Nomos. We for sure need. We for sure need to cut away with the heat or the logo. Anything. Griffies though. I'll take that down. Griffies is、uh, like more like a turf shoe. So like a for a, for a nigga that's not really like turfing like that and just come out with Griffies, it's like, ooh, what you got on? Yeah. Because Griffies is like I, what you pick up when you're on the turf. Like, I think. I think it's. It depends on colorway too. But it ain't that many colorways of grippy. What'd you get? Fresh water. You get the.、Uh, But I'm saying, cause like no, cause they they no, they they got some they got some turf colors. But like, those all like GS like, shit. It, it, Black them, and them, pink and exactly. Those are like the turf ones. The Cincinnati like, one is. Like the. Still looking for that. But like the OG colors though. That's、Fresh、that's a, that that's some motherfuckers that know some shit. Mariners. That's just like like phone pockets. Yeah, you know I mean like. You ain't just gonna catch motherfuckers on like no DB phones. Even goddamn the anniversary. Okay, me、phones. personally, I don't think phones or Air Force Ones really left the scene. It's for niggas that really fuck with them. But you see how、um, SBs came back. Yeah. What you think gonna come back? Phones or Air Force Ones before? As far as the masses, like Air Force Ones. Cause everything goes around. Like you think phones?、Yeah, I'll say Air Force Ones. Air Force, Air Force Ones. Air Force Ones. Cause I want to buy Air Forces right now. I still think phones gonna come back though. Somebody gonna wear no, they, phones. No, they, no, it's not. They'll go. They'll go. They'll go. They'll go. Cause they, cause they, cause they came. They, <laughs> they came. It's like phones came, then went like quick. But I always, I always thought phones was an East Coast shoe. You know what I mean? Like phones. Like I've phone. been wearing my phones lately because it's been raining. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But now, like, who gonna be in the summer in the, the sun with phones? With your foot sweating that goddamn hard. Okay, phones. Phones had their little had their little time in the sun and they went. I think once they start doing Weatherman, Spiderman, all that dumbass shit. Man, yeah, you know what I mean, like get the fuck out of here, repair asteroid, you know that dumb, yeah, yeah, repair band, man, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not about to play. <laughs>
they start doing all that bullshit, it's like, all right. What did they give um, Virgil a phone positive? It depends on what he do with that motherfucker. Yeah, but I damn at, at this point, no matter what he do with it, as long as he throw a zip tie on it, it's gonna go. No, I think if you put the parentheses on that bitch, <laughs> he'll put a big ass parentheses oh. off on the other side, white. <laughs> 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 no, you know, you know what what, what, what make happens. those go? If he makes the foam translucent. He he, you, he he would have to do that if if he if he want to make the motherfuckers go, he got to make that that foam translucent. If you make it translucent, the motherfuckers will go. Almost how them uh those those Jordan One Apex look. Yeah. yeah okay. Like that. If he do it like that, yeah, he he can make it go. I feel like if off white came on the phone, no matter what it is, it's gonna go. Cause you know how niggas get over off white. Right. <laughs> yeah. Of course. Who <laughs> eat? Wait, what y'all think about the Galaxy rookies coming back out? I think this shit is phones. I mean, that's no, part I'm of the phone family, yeah, but yeah. no, I know, but I, I feel like phones would, would would do more, would do better. Like yeah, a I'm, Galaxy phone. Yeah, I'm juicing. Sure. What the rookies? Yeah. I got a story. The only shoe I ever missed out on standing in line was Galaxy phone. I was at undefeated. Mm. There was, I guess, thirteen pairs, and I was fourteenth in line. Damn it! Cool. And I missed out. Damn. That was like the one shoe that's that got away from me. That shoe and that's like the only shoe that got away from me. Yeah, I, I feel like now 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 are we talking about it? I feel if uh depending on what these what the rookies do, the galaxy rookies do, that would the, the they, already released. The they already released. They did numbers. They did? Yeah, people okay. are already happy they got them. They didn't get okay. the glow the um the glow? The glow in the dark pods. Mm. The pods was black. Oh, so it was, pairs, huh? Yeah, the older pairs got the glow-in-the-dark pods. Yeah, that's right, that's right. The new pair don't got the glow-in-the-dark pods. So, so we, might, we might get Gal Galaxy phones. When it comes when it come <clears> down <throat> to any sneaker, niggas only want sneakers that's limited. I don't niggas care what nobody sneakers. say. People going to say, oh, they buy it for the hype or whatever, but I'm people buy shit. shoes. Y'all like, still ain't watch Patriot that good. No. That's the premium episode. Y'all cats. I was saying, watch, but people want shoes that are... I don't want to say they're limited because there's a lot limited, of shoes make it that's limited that didn't do numbers, but shoes that have resale value. I say, but shit, even just saying this, just saying it's limited makes it hype. Yeah, but like, like niggas had the CP three, uh, CP three thirteen, they didn't do numbers, and that was limited. True. The month they just did. Have have it, no, you know, did come back around. Yeah, you know, like, you know, they, you know, what it was. Value. Yeah, I, th I think why those didn't do that because them fucking mellows. The me the mellow thirteens look damn near similar. The CPs was first though. I, what I'm saying. Oh yeah. You know what I mean? It's, it's niggas no, doing. CP threes was first before. But no, yeah, for sure they was. But I'm saying like you know it's it's still motherfuckers that's like us that do probably do deeper research than we do. It was like. Straight to the outlet. I was at the outlet. Fine. If you wanted the outlet, you want. It wasn't for retail. It was a little bit less than retail, but. Because CP, CP, because it's what CP had the his logo on the tongue, right? Yeah. And the mellows didn't. I think the mellows just had the red tongue, but the uh, the shit was red though. What y'all think about them ones? What's on the tour? Kobe still got the best. In court shoes, you know, the hoop. I'm about. And with you, them, them Kobe's is comfortable as fuck. Oh. What was the, you talking about? Them Levitt's with that paint, oh, the one. That paint strip on it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, them <laughs> couture. No, them shoes. Them shoes is whack. Shoes trash. Because what people see in them? Because because my thing, I, I, I can I saw, see those going like high fashion though. You know, like, I, I, I saw I, I saw I saw the little the little story behind them. It was the it was supposed to be based off the bands. Those are supposed to be the stripes that was on the band. I could definitely see those being but, like, but they could have. I feel like they could have did that better. If you gonna if you gonna base them off band, right? Yeah. Had an X band on that motherfucker instead of just a band around that bitch. It looked like it, it was looks a red stupid. one. You duct taped the swooshes. Yeah, and, and just, just painted it black. black for me, you feel me? And pulled like, the tape off and you had custom. Right, right. That you see somebody wear that with a suit though. Nah, nah, people went wild for them. Yeah, I, I don't know why. But you, but you see that crease on it. No, more than one person I follow said that was the worst 
worst quality of a one yeah. in a long time. I feel like, I feel like they'll I feel for me, I feel like that they'll have been all black. You know how you get caught painting the shed red? <laughs> That's what that look like. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I think about when I see that shit. Them, you know how the Rugrats, remember how the I Rugrats don't like so? It's just, it's who just, painted the goddamn shed red? Right. It's, just, <laughs> it's just some shooters where you be like, nah, I'm not fucking with them. But oh, everybody shit. just gravitated toward them. Yeah, but nah, them right. couture ones, like, I would be right. happy to see those at the outlet. I still damn near would have picked those up for fifty. I, 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 that that white that that white soul. You would have to give them to me. me. I mean that cream soul. I feel like those those should have been all black. If they'd have been all black, I'd have been cool. Okay, let's end it with uh, what else is coming out? That's gonna be good. I know uh, Cool Grade Fours is coming out. Cool Grade Fours. Uh, get um, did four, Red Elevens get confirmed? I feel like they got confirmed. I feel I feel like that's gonna be Christmas. That's gonna be the Christmas thing. Uh, I still I still, still got fours. Hey, what? This is IG Live with Conceited. I think we'll still put that on with Conceited. That's whatever we're talking about right now. Yeah. I still want to say that we're going to get cool gray lemons this year, but I don't think we're going to get them in December. I think we're going to get them before December. You think this year? Yeah. This cool gray lemons? Summer. I th- I f- Summer. I feel like next year. Summer. Some, some tell me next year. Summer. <laughs> next year, summer. If they smart, they'll save them for next year. Cause I, I say feel like, I feel like say they drop December. cool grades before breads. Breads we get December. I'm what are we gonna get next year? Another Space Jam? Nah, I'm, I'm trying to think. Of, I'm trying to think of like hot Elevens. All the hot Elevens came. Snake skin lows. All, 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 the, all the hot Elevens came out of. So I feel like I feel like cool. I think they might save cool grade for next Christmas. If they were smart, they'd save them. Next I, I feel. I feel like they're gonna do that. I feel like they're gonna do that. Cause, cause you get cool grade fours. I feel like. But cool, like I always, I've been saying it from the beginning. I feel like that's gonna be, a, gonna be the cool gray year. Cause Glenn, what's happening? I feel like, um, I feel like, uh, goddamn, um, cool grade fours is gonna re- determine cool grade elevens. Oh, and man. I wouldn't be surprised if they change. Like, what year we in? Twenty nineteen. Yep. Yeah. So next year, twenty twenty. Yep. I wouldn't be surprised if they don't even use a 11 for a December shoot. That'd be something else. I think so. It, it, it could be. It could be. I feel like... Because um, you can't do 11 every December. Hey, you know what? Okay. <laughs> hey, you can. Hey, 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 you can do if, Space Jam for every December for five years in a row. If, if, <laughs> Nike, if Nike really want to be petty for 2020, you drop a Yeezy. Oh, I'm just going to say that. If you really want to be petty, because when Kanye was talking that goddamn 2020 really 20 shit, I'm running for president. Hey, you want to be petty? October's in October for be, 2020? Be petty. I'll be petty. And that's right before election, too? Be petty. Drop drop Red Octobers. Drop the Red Octobers with the MAGA hat. And just in case Nike... <laughs> and, right, look. And if, Nike, and if Nike listening, I need my fucking... We need our fucking money. Red Octobers with the MAGA hat for 2020. <laughs> As a as a pack. No, I don't even make. I need my Maya my Maya hat. Make Yeezy great again. God damn it! No, that's the name. Right, shit. Yeah. Maya. Where would Yeezy? Maya. Hey, where would Yeezy? I need my Maya. He was on the keyboard though. I need my Maya hat. That shit that been going viral when he was on the keyboard. Oh, I don't know. Was he in Africa or something? She was somewhere. I think it might have been in the Kardashians' backyard. Yeah, they might have been <laughs> but I ain't gonna lie with them. Okay, easy. I don't fuck with your political views, but you still got got dope music though. All right. <laughs>
Well, that's not even his song, though. No, but what, where was he at? When I he know that song. Oh. Man, dude, go crazy. Where was he at, though? <laughs> oh, he was doing that every Sunday. But I'm like, but that's a Sam <laughs> Cooke song. I don't know where the fuck he's at. He, he, he did Outstanding, too. I'm Outstanding. Yeah, you know what I mean? Did we oh, talk shit. about that? Other than that. Outstanding was about head. Other than that, just tune in next week. Oh, the electric slide was not about a vibrator. So why have you been having me tell the world that everywhere? What? Like, was up. It, it wasn't. I, I looked it up. It, they said the, the, the motherfuckers that made the song said, nah, it was, that's just the internet rumor. But, 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 well, but, but. until next week. <laughs>